but welcome back to MSM Tutorials. Today I am your host, the editor of the channel, and today we're going to be learning how to breed the awesome rare T Rox. He has some crystals poking out of him. He looks nothing. I mean, he looks similar, but almost fairly similar to his counterpart, regular T Rox. He has crystals in different places and has different colors. But today we're going to be learning how to breed him. So of course he just sounds like his counterpart. T-Rox, and I don't have a recording studio on this island, so we, we can listen to it. Let me buy the structure, I think. Okay. Uh-huh, that one? Alright, let's listen to what Ray T-Rox sounds like. He sounds just like T-Rox, so it will have no difference. Trust me. There's four tracks, so here we go. Get ready to get your socks blown off. Yeah, boy, now track two, boy, four, three, two, one. So on regular My Sea Monsters, Epics and Rare sound just like their common counterpart, but on Composer Island, they sound, they have a different sound. Non-Composer Island. Though. I meant on Composer App, like the my Seamox is composer app. Rares have different sounds on that, so don't be worried. They all sound the same on this this um game. So <laughs> Your boy. All right. So now we're gonna learn how to read. So rare T rocks. What you need to read them is log and mammoth. The higher the level the monster is, the better chance you have bring him. Quag is already at level 10, but Mammoth is only at level 7. So it's a little bit bigger, and we have a better chance of breeding rare T-Rocks. So what you need to breed rare T-Rocks is Mammoth, and then Quag. The higher amount of torches you have hit, the more likely you are to get the monster. We got regular T Rocks. See, when you're breeding the rares, you also might get the regular. I have no idea what that was. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, it was regular mammoth. Let's just be a So yes, he is awesome and cool, and um, he is just bred with Mammoth and Fog. Sounds just like regular T-Rocks, and sometimes if you breed, if you try to breed rare monsters, you might get their regular counterparts. That's just a warning. But thank you for watching this video, and please consider subscribing and also liking this video. And Turn your post notifications on so you get notified whenever we make a new My Sea Monsters video and learn how to breed some more epic monsters. Not necessarily epics, but that was just the context I use it in. Like rares and epics. Mainly the cool cooler monsters. Um, but now the sale is going on, we're gonna be making a lot more videos. So thank you for watching this video. Thanks to the sale of the new rare barb being out. 